Jamia Millia Islamia's application form has been opened. The application form closes by the 12th of this month. Everyone and anyone who is interested in getting into this prestigious university, which is ranked rank 10 at the All India level in the NIR rankings 2021 for BR, please do apply. In this session, we would be looking at how to apply or how to fill your form for this particular university. We are specifically going to deal with only BR. Hello everyone, this is Suraj and you are with Think Institute of Design. So this is the brief schedule that they had published. The online prospectus has already been opened from the 12th of April. It would be closing by 12th of May. So please note that you have to finish the application form within the 12th of May. You have the option of editing and things like that from 13th onwards. There is a separate admit card for uh, those students who are writing the separate admission test and all. But in case of BR, it is not like that. There won't be any separate entrance exams. This time, they're going to take completely based on the scores that are obtained in NATA. So just like how you have in, let's say, for example, Keem and all, it's very important to write NATA if you want to get into Jamia Milia Islamia's BR program. Okay. So while you're applying itself, you will have to give the application number of NATA, which you have used to uh, submit your application form in NATA. So the same application number from NATA, you will have to fill it in the Jamia's JMI's application form also. The rank list would be prepared based on the NATA scores, completely based on the NATA scores only. Okay. Now, this is the particular website. I would request the host to please share this particular website in the live chat box also. You go there, you can see a particular link specifically to apply for BTEC, BR, and all. And you can create a new profile there yourselves. You can enter the basic credentials like your exact correct name, date of birth, parents' name, things like that. Please give a password, which you can remember. Please write it down anywhere. Once that is done, you will get a brief of your details. We have masked those details here of this particular applicant. Once that is done, you will get an OTP or a verification mail into your email ID. Once you get that, this is a screenshot of what you get in the email ID. Once you get that, you can click on this. You can verify this particular profile or application form that you have given, and it will be activated. Once that is activated, you can log in with your email ID and password, the password that you have created now and the email with which you have used to verify this particular profile of yours that you have created in the JMI's website. Once that is done, you log in, create using these credentials and you go to your application. In that, you have to select BTEC BR and specifically in the course name, we have to give BR in that. Once you give BR, you can agree to the various conditions that they have told. These are the basic steps that you need to give. There are six steps. First one is the application details, wherein you provide your details, uploading of photographs and signatures. Then you need to provide your academic details. Fourth is uploading the certain documents that are required. Fifth is the preference that is required. We'll come to what is preference, what are the various kinds of seats and things like that. Meanwhile, for everyone who is watching, if there are any questions, queries and all, please do not hesitate to ask us in the live chat box. We would be happy to answer. After the document, uh, after uh, uploading the documents and preferences, you can preview, confirm and give the payment. If, you're, uh, if you have to give the payment, you can give the payment. Okay. Now, this is the point that I was talking about earlier. In case of Chamiya's form, you have to give the NATA application number. So it is inevitable and important that you fill the NATA application form have an ATA application number so that you can fill the JMI application form also. Okay. Once that is done, you have to give the category that you belong to. Uh, Gamer Inevitable has asked a question. Is this a good college for architecture? This is definitely a good college <clears throat> in terms of architecture rankings that are published every year by the central government. That is NIR of rankings, National Institute of Rank National Institute Ranking Frameworks. It is ranked rank 10 in the all India level. So it's definitely a good college that you can get to. They have a very good, strong architecture department and all. Okay. So you can give your social category that you belong to. There are various questions like gender, annual income, particular category, community that you belong to and things like that that are asked. You can fill all of that. You can give your permanent address and things like that. You can fill all those basic rudimentary details, upload the photograph and also the signature. There are certain criteria that they have uh, mentioned here with respect to the photograph, there is the size that is specifically mentioned. 
and uh, in case of signature also it's the same they have mentioned clearly uh, chitra gupta asks i only applied for j can i also apply for jmi so uh, i i would request you to first apply for nata once you apply for nata please then you can uh, with that application number you can definitely apply for jmi okay see please note in this year's notification by uh, i think it was by je that they have very clearly mentioned that uh, get into nits spas and cfts they'll take je but for all the other exams they'll have to clear nata there was a slight confusion last year regarding all of this but this year they have clearly communicated all of that so i would request everyone to definitely write nata at any and every cost okay how much score would we need to get nata approximately to get this college we're not sure about that because last year from what i remember they had done it via je and last to last year i think they had separate exams or something of that sort so we're not exactly sure about that but please please do apply via nata okay uh your 10 12 standard or if you have done a 3 year or uh, 4 year diploma you can enter those marks and all uh then uh, uh, you have to this is one thing that i had to explain about the preferences there are two types of uh, seats ajmal noor there is a question asked for the last rank probably seat that's what i said uh, this year they are conducting via nata last year they had conducted it via je so we are not exactly sure we can't give out like what was the exact last score in case of nata Uh, in case of jam okay now there are two preferences that you can give there are two types of seats one is br or the br what they call is regular the other one is br self finance so basically by self finance i think you understand that self finance is something that means you are financing it right exactly same it is you have to give the entire uh, tuition fee hostel fee mess fee and things like that but the other seat the regular one is the one that is funded by the university or the aid that financial aid that university is getting why are that they will fund the br seat so obviously the br seat would be cheaper br self finance would be a bit more costly so either way the one the way you want to select which one you feel is of higher priority you can definitely select it br would be a little bit more less expensive br self finance would be a little bit more higher okay after that you can get a brief um, idea of your application form that you have given you can get the details and all uh, you can just cross check that whether you have given all the details correctly and all okay now we have our batches for nata je paper 2 and all those have applied for nata those who have applied for je paper 2 and all we have our batches for je nata and all some of the batches have start started already some of the batches are coming up so our batches would be in english hindi and malayalam so whichever one you are comfortable in you can take those batches there are english batches there are malayalam batches there are hindi batches also so which are once you are comfortable you can definitely join and there is a special uh, price that we have kept for all the students who are preparing for je paper 2 for everyone scoring above 99.5% in je paper 2 they will be getting a smart watch uh, is there a separate exam for jmi no in this case in case of br is what we are talking about rtx himanshu we do not have a separate exam gamer inevitable in 12th cbse uh, how much marks will be good for a good score in nata there are two things in that one is the state in which you are applying for so basically if you are applying in kerala and all i would definitely say it's definitely it's much better to score more than 90 percentage but it also depends upon your state how which state you belong to and what is the usual top mark and all so in case of kerala if you want to get into the top four colleges government and government aided colleges definitely you will have to get more than 90 95 percentage it would be a very good score. okay i hope i have answered most of the questions if there are any more please keep shooting uh towards the end of this you can give a confirmation in the application form if all the details are correct you can confirm uh, this and confirm and submit once you have done that you can proceed to the payment now you have the option of online payment and all you can give the online payment there is an online mode that is available whatever is the fee that is applicable to you you can pay that uh, you can pay that if you belong to the general category it's somewhere around 500 and okay now if there are any more questions regarding jmi's admissions or even regarding any of the institutions admissions and things related to that please do not hesitate to post it you can either post it via this particular video so below this video you can post it or you can directly contact us i would request the host to please share the number you can contact us at 
216 or 8086114188. Just change the last three digits. Okay. Yes, the host has already shared. Okay. So that would be it about Jamia Millia Islamia's uh, admission process. It's a very good college, at least as per the NIR of rankings and all. It's quite good. We have a lot of students who have joined from our institute last year also. So definitely uh, vouch for that. The, I think it, uh, it's ranked rank 10 at the national level in terms of BR colleges in 2021 NIR of rankings. Okay. So if there are any more questions, please do contact us. We have our uh, JE and BR batches, uh, sorry, JE and NATA batches that are starting in a short while. So you can contact us and you can join us. We would be happy to help you. Okay. So that would be it in this session from Suraj and Think Institute of Design. Thank you everyone until we see you in the next one. Thank you host.